Glory to God. Hallelujah. God says, check your hands. God says, check your hands. This is a very urgent word from God to you. It's a very urgent word. Please watch to the end to get what God says about these. This is prayers and counseling with Damaris. If you're coming across my channel or seeing me for your very first time, you're welcome. I love you so much. God bless you mightily in the name of Jesus. If you're yet to subscribe, please consider doing that. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Let us pray. Father, we thank you for everyone watching me right now. I thank you for their lives. I thank you for everything that they are doing, Lord. I pray that may you bless the works of their hands in the name of Jesus. I pray for blessings beyond human understanding in the name of Jesus. Amen. God says, check your power. Now, the Bible says when Jesus resurrected and he appeared to the disciples, God says, the Bible says, they asked if he was really the Messiah, if it was him or it was another. And he showed his hands as an evidence to them that this was him, that it was him. He showed his hands as an evidence to them that it's not another person, it is him. He asked them, what are you looking for there? When the one whom you look for has resurrected. Jesus showed his palms to them as an evidence to them that he was the one. Because now God is saying that there are some miracles that are going to come your way that people will need evidence for them to believe that it is you. There is a miracle, a blessing that God is about to entrust into your hands. He's about to give it to you that men will be baffled and you will need to show them an evidence. Now the Lord has sent me here to tell you. He says that he's about to give you an evidence to show your haters. He's about to give you an evidence to show your mockers. He's about to give you an evidence to show those who have written you off. Those who said that you will not prosper. Those who said that nothing good will come out of your children. Those who said that nothing good will come out of what you are doing. You amount to nothing. God says he's about to give you an evidence to show them. He's about to give you an evidence to show them. The Bible says when the Lord sent against the captivity of Zion, he says they were like men that dreamed and their mouths were filled with laughter. They were like men that dreamed. There are some blessings that come into your life and you feel like it is a dream. There are some things that God does to for your life, does in your life and you think it is a dream. Now the amazing part is and it was said in the hidden. The Lord has done great things for this one. It means that the people in the hidden understood and they knew what the people were going through. And they have been watching, they have been seeing. He says they were like men that dreamed and their mouths were filled with laughter. Now the Bible didn't tell us that they went to show off, show off their miracle or show off their blessings. But there were people who were watching and seeing what they were going through. Seeing everything that they were going through. And then they believed that this only could be God. Since the Lord has done great things for this one. God says as you hear me speak, as you hear me speak, the, your mockers, your enemies are going to say, the Lord has done great things for this one because he is about to unveil a, a big miracle. He's about to open a mighty miracle. He's about to change your life. He's about to give you a testimony. He's about to elevate you. The Lord is about to change your life in the name of Jesus. Now may the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord cause his face to shine upon you. May the Lord be gracious to you. May the Lord give you peace in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The shalom of the Lord. Nothing missing, nothing broken. I love you, child of God. But Jesus loves you and I even more. And that is what matters. Amen. Hallelujah.